Okay. Just gonna give it a couple of seconds first. Crossing my fingers. All right, so I made it past 30 seconds. All right, good. <clears throat> no more Skype. I need to let a few people know. Um, not here, obviously. Check and see if there are currently any viewers watching. It's going to happen sooner or later. <clears throat> okay, so it looks like I have about eight people. Nine people. Hey, Wheel of Steel. Hey, Birch. Hey, Nano Bite Streams. Hello, War Hero. Nixilla. Um, I'm testing some more games and see how well they um, how well they perform when I'm live. Because there's that whole shit. I mean, it's one thing to play games on you know your computer regularly, but when you're live. Um, it's only a matter of how well the performance is and how smooth the you get what i mean so i've already tested a few emulators um yeah i'm gonna do another test run um it's well um i wouldn't say tired uh i'm just like I'm getting myself a little bit warmed up to an extent where, yeah, I'm going to sound a little, uh, uh, like a little tired, but do we know how Genesis games run? Yeah, that's the other thing. I want to give another run on uh, the Genesis emulator because I've noticed uh, two things. First of which is that the screen size, I didn't even realize it, but the screen size was bigger than it should. Um... The other of which is that I think uh, there's a little check that says set to high priority or something like that. I want to see if that makes any difference as well. Um, but I'm pretty sure that a smaller screen size would help run the, the emulator more smoothly. And if it works well, then cool. I have more options, and that would be pretty cool. By the way, hi back to uh, Finn and Takara. Hope you guys are having a good time on your stream, I'm guessing. Oh, they're doing Pokemon. Okay, let's go Pikachu. Yeah. So yeah, um, tell Finn and Taka I said hi back, and 
you know what would be funny if all three of us would be in uh, like in the same call together. I think that'd be adorably fun. So, uh, the hardest game called Fatal Rewind. I'll have to look into that. Hey, Snickerman. I've never heard of Fatal Rewind, but yeah. Um, so yeah. I think it's time I start to um, transition the screen to the uh, the current one. I also want to let you guys know that. Upon uh, doing this test run, around midway, supposedly, um, I had to drop Kefirm off at Planet Fitness. Um, she, uh, I had to drop her off somewhere, which will be a short, I don't know, 30-minute run or something like that, or break. Um, luckily, I do have um, a little notification where it says, uh, you know, BRB, you know, because you got to have that in there. So, buck and five. Do you and Key have any Valentine's Day plans? Um, not necessarily. Not that I know of. Let's see. He's up. I'm tired. As I'll get out. So I'll be heading to bed soon. All right, Snickerman. Rest well. Good to hear your voice again. I'm going to tag you because I'm tired. Oh, tag out. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, like I said, this is a late night thing, so it's not for everybody. So um, I'm going to give another test run to the Genesis emulator and see if, because um, I've made some changes to it. I don't know if there are any, um, I don't know if the results are going to change or not. In the meantime, I have to, um, I got to double check and make sure that the volume is uh, turned appropriately. Uh, <clears throat> come on, let me get to, dude, what the hell? <clears throat> The entire city of Tides. I come from the land of sweetness incarnate. Okay. Hell and back. Okay. Okay, so apparently the master control, the sound master control systems are not working currently. Why don't I see any notifications on my main screen? Hang on. No, 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 no. Um, they should work. <clears throat> that's weird I'm guessing um, it's at a different position or something I don't know let me give another test run because for some reason um, ah, there we go okay this is really odd like, not even on my actual window. It's not, like, showing me the notifications. That's weird. Let me, uh... Let me go to my Streamlabs and check something. Good thing this is a little test run. Chrome, I would appreciate it. All right. <clears throat> If you have that game. Oh, I have columns. I definitely have columns. That was um, that was something ideal that voice was recommending me because of Bliss's OC on Tetris. So, yeah. Am I getting Kingdom Hearts 3? Hell no. I do not like Kingdom Hearts. I've already just pissed off a shit ton of people answering that question. <clears throat> Part of me feels like I should have kept a Streamlabs page up. Because whenever I go live, a lot of shit is going to slow down because of the CPU. I don't think anyone's going to hold it against you. I, okay, whenever I say the hurl, like, uh-oh, people are going to hate me for having a different opinion, I already know that, like, I, I, I meant to say it in a joke full manner, like... Because I know that people, like, for the most part, I've had people who respect uh, what my own decisions are, you know, instead of, um, 
you know, trying to put anything that is, you know, from a different opinion that I have on a pedestal. <laughs> Excuse me, I gotta take care of something real quick. <laughs> Alright, sorry about that. Just trying to, um, I just got through having a very mild cold, so I had, like, a runny nose. Like, the cough is already done and over with. Let me give a test follow. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I see that works. Oh, there we go. For some reason, it didn't make the sound. Oh, there we go. Now it makes the sound. Okay, what's, what's, the, what was the other notification? What the hell? I couldn't tell how many people have talked about me getting to the remastered RE2. Da, da, da. Said that if you finish streaming early, he would love for you to join his call, and if he ends early, he'd love to join you in a call. Well, um, it really all depends on what's currently happening. I mean, there's nothing too big out of the ordinary for um, for this one, since once again, it's a test run. Okay, so the weird thing is, is that even when I was testing the Genesis, even the um, even the emulator itself was running really, really slow, and not just what was on the stream, if you know what I mean. Um, go ahead, Birch. Uh, if, if there's something you need to say real quick, go ahead and say it. You know, as long as it's nothing too personal. All right, so... Let's go ahead and test. Um, let's first start off with Sonic. Let's let's go with Sonic Two. I hope that the uh, sound is lowered. I mean, at the very least, there should be like a little sound option here. Okay, I hope it's not too loud or anything like that. How was my holiday? My holiday was pretty good. I hope the game's not too loud on your guys' end. Sonic 76? What the fuck do you mean Sonic 76? Is that supposed to be a Fallout joke? Because if it is, then... I, I don't even know what to think of because a lot of people really don't like um, a lot of people don't like what you would call it Fallout 76 it's really hard for me to concentrate talking about shit when I'm playing my games I guess that's something I need to work on when I'm streaming what the I fucking hit him what kind of horse shit is that Oh, I'm sure that this game is a mass, like, childhood to a lot of you guys, so. Whoa. Okay, I thought spikes were going to pop out there. I guess not. Hello, Admiral Spraker, Tholmes 2014, and... Hmm. Do -do -do. Sonic 98, by the way. Seems like Golden is having his commentary peak when he rages. Oh, I'm sorry. Was I too loud? I think I need to change the uh, the volume mic because I don't want to. I don't want to cause any of that. If, if it's too, um, if I'm too loud on the mic, I'll go ahead and turn that down. I mean, this is a test run, so. Oh, of course I played Streets of Rage, Birch. Fucking love it. I'm gonna test that game next. Okay, my oh, like my personal favorite is always uh the second one. Yeah, here we go. Streets of Rage. Two. Let's test this shit out. Yes, I know of the trilogy. The second one just happens to be my favorite. Always like to have more lives because why not? So, hey, Brad, are you... Uh, so far I'm streaming by myself. I've entered a separate call in a different server with uh, a lot of my close colleagues. I'm guessing they're busy with something, but you know, I always keep it open. 
you know, whenever they go to join. I'm pretty sure that they're going to try to jump in a, throw a jump scare in for the sake of it, because why the hell not? People love it when I get fucking freaked out. It's always going to create, you know, you know, just by talking about this, I now have this, like, nagging fear that somebody's going to come in and say something really loud and scare the sh fucking taillights out of me. You, get out of here. Get over here. So far, this game is playing well. Fox, not fun. What? I, I I don't get that. They also it's also good enough, although it might be developing some hearing problems. Um, if you're talking about the volume, I turned it down really really low, so that way, first of all, it's not too distracting. It's always nice to have game sounds or you know, the audio of your game while you're streaming and having a conversation. But at the same time, you don't want it to be loud and distracting, especially, you know, since, you know, companies like Nintendo and such like to claim, you know, make copyright claims on YouTube because they'll do that. They care more about the profit than they care about uh, other kinds of shit in which the less I talk about, the better, because I'm not here to make this stream a fucking cynical nature. I'm just... Here to have fun, test shit out, make sure everything goes accordingly well. And so far, I don't see any issues, no lagging, none of that shit. Oh, whoops. I forgot that I have that. Ah, yes, the pipe. One smack and you're fucking dead. This thing is powerful as hell. You get over here. Yeah, no, bitch, you're not gonna fucking hit me. No! Why did you spend your time picking up another pipe? You already have one. Instead, you let this pathetic excuse of a dagger just jab right into you. Fuck you, Galgia? Galgia? I don't know how you pronounce that. Let's see. They'll scare, the, they'll scare the living daylights out of you. Gee! You think that wasn't any more obvious, Thorns? Alright. God! Okay. It's kind of funny, like, obviously the game is fun to play, but the reason why I really like Streets of Rage 2 is really because of the graphical performance and the sound behind it. Just the overall performance of the game in, oh, like, over its gameplay. It's more of a style over substance of a reason, but it's a very gorgeous looking game for, you know, 16-bit standards. Maybe that's just me, but I really love the colors they work with. Fuck you! Oh my god, get the fuck up. Yeah, you wanna you wanna laugh at me again? You wanna laugh at me again? Yeah, nah. <laughs> Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? You want more of the blade? You want more of the shit? I'm guessing he fucking died. Alright, well wait, wait, no, oh Oh! Oh, you wanna you think that's funny? Yeah, fuck you! Yoink. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Unless Adam ruins it. Because he certainly ruined milk and orange juice. You. Ooh, two in a row. Kapow, bitch. And... Ooh. That's right, join with them. <laughs> Taste my fist, Donovan. I have to wait until like, I punch the person, so that way I'll know what their names are. Here's this dominatrix here. Electra. Alright, so that's your name. Fuck you. Try to whip me, bitch. Go ahead. Well, well, I, she succeeded. You fucking whipped me. Didn't do much. Ooh. Yes, Electra starred in her own movie before. That's not the same one. Derek, what the fuck? 
Um, no. Uh, when it comes to um, yeah, no, it's it's gonna still be twenty four. I much prefer it that way. I always like it when I when I present something that's um, you know, something out of the uh, uh, making it look like a film look. It's to me, it's much easier on the eyes than it is you know watching everything move so smoothly that it feels a little too uncanny for me. That's only a personal preference, though. Some people like high frame rates. Um, not too big on that one. Oh, yeah, you're big in all that. Yeah, you think you could kick my ass. Don't think so, buddy. Ow, I didn't want... I didn't come here to taste your foot, you little bastard. Why did I even say little? He's not little. Oh, yeah, look at you, all big and buff. Now who's getting their ass kicked? Why does he keep on doing that? I guess that's his only thing right now. Yeah, lovely. Get over here. Ow! You shitbag. That's right. Fuck you and the horse you rode in on. I'm done playing this game. Yeah, what Jedi Padawan said. Okay. Is there a video game where you get a bad ending for playing in easy mode? There's a there's a number of them. Uh, Birch, I don't have any Sega CD games. Um, I only have Genesis. So, all right, let's test the other games that I had on the previous streams and see how well they go, how well they work. Maybe it's just those ones in particular. Oh, that's pretty cool. You can play as Vector Man on top of the Sega logo. That's hilarious. Ask Golden Fox, are you excited for 2019? I hope it goes out well. Like, I'm not going to count my chickens before they hatch. Because if you start to create expectations on what the following year is, you're going to set yourself up for disappointment. Alright, so... It looks like it's working well. Okay, so I'm guessing it was the screen resolution. Because uh, previously the screen was too high, and I'm guessing that was too much for the CPU to handle. Ow, fuckhead! Piss off! Alright. Yoink. Jumping over ledges. Ah! Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Alright. I don't know what's over here. Ow! Shit! God damn, Brett, why did you land over there? Ooh, another TV to blow up. We interrupt this program to bring you explosions. Directed by Michael Bay. <laughs> Ow! Teach you to shoot me, you fuckhead. Come on, get that. There we go. All right, so it looks like the game is running pretty well. Fuck you! Ah, d Jesus Christ. Oh, what is this? Whoa! Jesus. All right, because I had to re uh, retract where I was. It's weird that they're like invisible freaking platforms. And I'm guessing there's a little gap right there. So one of the biggest things happening on my end this year is my daughter's going to start first year. Oh, congratulations, Jesse. Your daughter's growing up. Is she going to preschool or kindergarten? Because I, I didn't keep track. Uh, like I Because I don't know your daughter's age. All I know is that she's very, very little. And you sent me uh, video clips of her mentioning me. A son of a... Where is the... All right, fine. I'm just going to continue going forth. Hello, Luigi Man 87 We interrupt this broadcast to bring you explosions. Oh. You spin me right round, baby. Oh, well, okay. Never mind. So much for singing that song when he was doing that. That was embarrassing. Oh. 
What emulator am I using for the Genesis? It's called uh, K Fusion or Fusion. It's uh, supposedly it's open for a wide variety of uh, early Sega games, like Sega CD and Sega 32X. I don't know if it's uh, open for like Game Gear and such. I'll have to look into that. Ooh, got a machine gun. I'm gonna take a blast right there. You piss off, stupid gun turret. You looking for your leggings? Yeah. Um, I think they may be in there too. Oh, nice. Oh, there you are. Thank you. You're welcome. Whoa. You wanna drop me off after you're done I can I can stop midway and drop you off and continue. Okay, so. Okay, um, are you gonna cook the chicken before or after? Before. Okay, so if you want, just. Yeah, so go ahead and, um, like, preferably just go ahead and get it out of the way. Yeah, and, well, I'll just go after you're done streaming. You'll be done streaming at, like, what, 10? Oh, honey, I don't mind company here. You're fine. No, you'll be done streaming at, what, 10? Uh, I guess. What the hell is that noise? Okay. Eh, I'm doing a late night stream. You're not touching me, bitch. You're not gonna touch me. That's right, you ain't touching me. Um, not yet. Oh, great. He touched some, me. I have some to eat some chicken, rice, and peppers if you want it. Oh, thank you. Do you want me to heat it up, or do you just want me to take the Tupperware out? Um, shit. Ah! Sorry, uh, let me pause that for a second. Uh, okay, so what was the uh, question again? Sorry. Here's the Tupperware. Do you want to heat it up yourself, or me heat it up for you? Uh, go ahead and heat it up for me. Yes, master, whatever you say. <laughs> Also, I'll take care of the uh, the kitchen dishes, so. Yeah. I mean, my cold is already, like, come and gone. Alright. For some reason, I always have trouble with this boss. Like, I know the agilities and everything, but still, I get my ass kicked. Oh, what? Ugh. Wait, any chance you're streaming Steam games anytime? Oh, yes, that actually is uh, on my to-do list. But uh, let's test another game. Because so far, it seems to be running smoothly. So there's a good chance that, you know, I might do some uh, Genesis games. So that'll be fun. Ouch, indeed. There we go, and... Which columns do I have? Um, I think I have the first. Alright. Seems to be going well. All right, let me try columns, and then I'm going to uh, I'm going to test a couple of Steam games and see how that goes. I need to ask a very difficult question. What are the requirements for being a good critic? I'm not asking for editing or writing tips, but how to criticize. Be okay with people disagreeing with you. Yeah, I think that's the first major thing to come across. There really is no like scientific explanation on how to give criticism. Just give out your feelings on it. Um, I'm not really the best person to look to to give um golden gets angry at people <laughs> oh thank you honey all right have i played earthroom gym 2 yes i have i didn't make that much progress though um yeah give it until okay so they switched down Alright. 
Oh, interesting. All right. Um, no matter what, that's not going to matter for shit. Ooh, 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 wait, wait. Yay. Oh, that's right. I can create diagonal ones. That's pretty cool. There we go. Um... I think I might be able to... Oh. Alright. Shit. Alright, um... Alright, cool. That actually worked well in my favor. Okay. Shit. Alright, um... Damn it. There we go. Yoink. Match those. Alright, so that's basically the gist of this game. Cool beans. There we go. That's a good row right there. I'm not Night Flash, I'm Nightfall. Damn it. Wait, what? Oh. That's just anywhere you put it. That's not going to mean shit. Because it's extra, I don't know, a rose or some shit like that. Oh, if I could put that here. Okay, that was pretty cool. There we go. Crap. If I can take it midway. Awesome. Alright, awesome. Let's take it midway. This is an interesting type of puzzle game compared to like other puzzle games that I've played. But yeah, no, this will be a this will be an interesting game to play at some point. Well, I set myself up there. There we go. That takes care of that. Whoa! Oh, damn it! I have no one to blame by myself on that one. Ooh, yes. Thank you. Alright. I think I'm just about done with that. Let's go ahead and give a test run do a couple of Steam games. Let's lower this. And let's go ahead and lower this. Alright, so what game should I test first? I mean, there's already a couple of games that I've already tested in the past, but I just wanted to test again just to make sure. Um, let's see. Let's try Bloodstained. Um, I forgot who got me this game, but um, thank you for getting me it. I think it was Jedi Padawan Daniel. Yes, it was. Yeah, I'm just about to test the game out. Let's see how well it runs. Holy shit, that is a giant ass screen. Something tells me things are going to be a little difficult to work with. Bloodstain is supposed to be some kind of um, a carbon copy of uh, Castlevania that kind of has its own uh, its own thing. You know? Oh, that's right. Um, I tried, uh... I tried lowering the screen resolution before. Good lord. Viewing mode, windowed, obviously. Oh. One... Let's put it at one. Oh, damn. Okay, let's put it at two. What the hell? Why isn't it? Oh. Okay, that's... I mean, this vision... It, it's visible. I just had to enlarge and... Um... There we go. That's That seems more appropriate. Because I can't have a screen too big. Um... I apologize in advance for the... Well, then again, this is a test run, so what the hell am I even apologizing for? Uh, 
All right, let's go ahead and do that. There, that's better. All right. Mighty Gunvolt? I don't know what that is. Gun mode, okay. All right, so now it's saving. There we go. I technically do have a call open, it's just that there hasn't been anybody there. Veteran and casual, all right. It's definitely on the laggy end. Okay, that's the attack button. God damn, he's jumping like he's walking on the moon. Oh my god. This game is laggy as hell. I think there's one other thing that I may need to fix. That's not what I meant. Huh. Looks like I can control the quality. So I'm guessing the game is a little too, uh, too much to handle. I do think it's a good game. Um, it's just really, really slow as hell right now. So. Yeah, like, I didn't expect it to like this much. Alright, well. Doesn't look like I should be uh, streaming this game. Not all games are winners, so. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and just close that one. Yes, close the game. Alright, let's try another game. Oh yeah, there's something else that, um, for some weird reason this happens. Let me, uh, go ahead and take it out. Alright. Alright. All right, let's go ahead and try Freedom Planet again, and hope that there's no problems there. I think this is kind of a thing for nearly every Steam, <clears throat> every Steam game. They're just going to run really, really slow. Not sure why. Jesus. Let's get straight to the stages. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> uh, the call is taken elsewhere.
Maybe there's something I need to do to get this to perform faster. Oh my god, Nick, what did you just send me? Good god. Alright, so what is this? Bro Force. Okay. Um, I'll gladly accept, even though I have no idea what the fuck this is. It's weird, it used to run fine before, and now this one's just lagging like crazy. Maybe there's just something I need to... Alright, so it's a sky-scrolling uh, platform shooter. I didn't say that right. Is it ceiling size? Hmm. Normally, I just remembered if Bado had a similar name. Hmm. It could just be that there's just too much shit running. I think I maybe need to close down a few things. Good lord. This is ridiculous. This is something I'm going to have to look up. Yeah, fuck you. Even when Lilac is walking on the moon, he, she can still kick your ass. Why won't memes die? I tried poking fake bullets in them. What? I have no idea what the fuck you guys are talking about. Lagging. This is such lagging. This is such... Yeah, this stopped working. I'll have to look this stuff up. Alright, I need to take that out. Again, for some reason, it, um... I think I know what the other problem is. Maybe it's just me. Let's see if I can... Because something else when it comes to the resources is that... You got the little eyeball that indicates, you know, anything that opens, um, it starts to run automatically. I'm guessing that's what the problem was. We'll see if that makes any difference. So let's try running it again and see how well it performs after that. Because maybe that could be the case. Ugh, you guys are giving me so many fucking games, it's kind of embarrassing. Ah, 
night. Let me uncheck a few more things that don't need to be running right now. I already have the donation bar, chat box. Everything else, I think it's fine. Ah! That was stupid. Well, it's running a little faster. There's still a little bit of lag going on, so... Is my fridge running? I don't even know what that's supposed to mean. I mean, there is progress, but... I need to figure this shit out. Ow! Oh, bastard. Teach you to hurt me. God, that guy takes a lot of punishment. actually help if I, you know, transferred it over. Oh. Okay. I think it's playing better. Of course, that's one thing I didn't notice. Yeah, it's, it's a private one. Oh, yeah. This is playing so much better now. Alright, so this is something I'm going to have to keep a mental note of. There's still a little bit of lag, but it's tolerable. There we go. Ha! You missed. I, 
I have yet to try out the demo for um, Freedom Planet 2. I'm a little mixed about it. Um, it's going to be a little difficult to try to go into full detail about it. Um, I did hear that they fixed Mila's um, uh, character controls and other kinds of problems that people had in the in this game. But um, I I. I I need to test out the demo, you know, before I can really be excited, but so far the style is a little, I, I think it's trying too hard to be a little more adult, which it can go in two places, either it can be really, really better, or it would just be for to play the original, I don't know. Oh, let me see if this will help. Yep, there we go. Keep forgetting about that. How is it that she's able to swing on one of the sides of the ladder and, like, go through their pillars or their footsteps? That doesn't make any sense. I shouldn't be questioning the logic of this game, and yet I still am. Whatever. and this is something I'll have to get used to. I mean, it's not nearly as laggy as it was before. What the hell was that? Heard a little fuzz right there. What's this game supposed to be? It has uh, three playable characters. Ah! Fuckhead. Oh. For some reason, I can't hurt that one. There. Just bounce right up there. Is this the Indiana Jones part, or is that... No, that's still a little ways away. That's right, there are collapsing bridges that I have to take care of. Let me take care of this asshole. God, that explosion always feels satisfying. Come on, get the rest of those crystals. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, so I had to go back up again. Grab onto one of the little latches. Jesus, that boulder almost hit me. Whoa, that was pretty cool. Alright, so if you hold down while swimming, you create this little down kick. Alright. Hmm. Belongs in a museum. What belongs in a museum? I'm not gonna bother with these dancing trees. Fucking hell. Okay, I think this is the um, the Indiana Jones part. Yep. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. 
What the hell? Do you know what you can pass the boss on in this stage? <laughs> ah! Don't run the lag there, that happens naturally. It did not scare the fuck at me, and it did not work. It did not work, Bliss. Fail! 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 <laughs> Bliss snuck into the call and tried to scare me using a sound clip from Jurassic Park. Those, the screechy sound for the Veloc- uh... The Raptors? Yeah. I'm just like, you know that if you go to use sound clips, it's not gonna do shit. <laughs> What? If it, if it was just a really, really slow building sound, like, what the hell is that? And then it's ear rape. <laughs> nah, do, nah, I don't do ear rape. Yeah, no, she does not do ear rape. Nobody likes ear rape. I don't rape. like doing that. Excuse me. <laughs> Try to avoid it. How dare you assume my preference of memes? Did I really? Excuse me, princess. I didn't know I was on key frame. Stand. <laughs> <laughs> I have to admit, though, that's pretty funny. <laughs> Mr. Failed. We'll get him next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing Peter taught you about the um, the Call of Duty memes. No, he's just been saying them, and I've been copying. Yeah, no, Mr. he failed. He, we'll get him next time. Yeah, that happens every time there's a failed attempt of anything. <laughs> All right. uh, uh, I just spent a lovely few hours losing dinosaurs and getting new dinosaurs. I got attacked by an alpha. Oh, I just realized. And there we go. There we go again with the lag of the call. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Oh, okay. Anyway, my ig just protect me and take on the Alpha Raptor, but he died. Getting out of it. Got my Raptor. I figured we'll go on a boat trip to find another Iguanodon to be friends. Didn't find one. There we go. Alright, let's try it up. All right, let's see how well this plays. After, after, oh, we'll go. All right, let's hope this game runs smoothly. Before anything else, let me check. Okay, under video. Here we go, quality low, effects. Let's put it to low. All right. Alright, let's see how well this runs. 
I hope it runs good, because I really want to, like, at least play this game. Like, it would be, like, an interesting blind let's play. Here. And once again, Discord is being a piece of crap. Oh, shit. I forgot to transition it. All right, blah, blah, blah. No, 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 continue. Yes, Edwin, this is Hollow Knight. This is the game that Solar has been streaming. So far, it's running pretty okay. Oof. Oh. Why must this happen? Okay. Hang up, let's let me work on it. So, okay. Discord. Oh, wait. I don't see anything under here. Maybe it's under services. What the hell? Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. Hello. There you are. It's it, it it does that sometimes. Holy shit! The CPU is at a hundred. Yeah. All right, Discord, where are you? Okay, how about now? I got nothing. I don't know why, but Discord has lately been a pain in the dick every time I streamed. The call is, I mean. <clears throat> I hear a sniff. Oh, there you are. Duh. Yeah, I'm here. You lagged out a bit. I'm going to go ahead and close the game. Because the game is running fine, it's just every single time I'm live, the call goes to shit. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Okay, so the game is now closed, and I think you're sounding normal. Yeah, you. I could tell the qual call quality on your is kind of 
Screw it up, though. I mean, is, is Discord really taking up that much CPU? I thought it was one of those, um... Wait, what is the stream kit? All right, so I'm gonna have to look up this crap. All right. Mm. Really hear me? I on the stream, I think. Okay, so <laughs> OBS Discord call lag. Lag audio with Discord. All right. I'm searching online to find results. Oh, there you are. Okay, so Jesse suggests I use Skype. I don't know if that's going to make any difference at all. I would argue Skype uses up more than Discord. All right, so let's see. Updating audio dri driver to the latest version would be the good first step. Does this need an update? No, it doesn't. All right. Board real t if it's on board real tag, get it directly <laughs> from then. What? Okay. Huh? Real tech. I don't know what that is. So yeah, I've updated my audio drivers, but there's always the problem. Okay, install. What is this? Core audio. Okay. Do you have a download link for Core Audio for Windows 10? Let's see. Please read my last post. <laughs> it always seems to be when you try to play some more higher tech games. I noticed. Yeah. Either that, or when I run an emulator. I mean, as is, whenever I was testing those, it started to lag up a bit. Mm -hmm. So, uh, that should definitely be an indicator. Yeah. And, yes, I am enjoying art. Thanks for asking. But I need to get back into some play some Spyro. But I, here's the problem. I'm really busy. <laughs> it's like, I'm going to enjoy my, my opportunities of gaming for this week because then i got to get back to work on a TF2 vid. Yeah. I don't know what Columns is. Oh, Columns is a, um, oh, let me show you. It's kind of like Tetris where you're moving blocks around, but you have to make rows. It's one of those uh, kind of games. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let me go ahead and just boot that up. At least Fusion is working well, but when it comes to stream, um, Steam games, mm -hmm. it can lag a bit, and for some reason, it just it takes up too much CPU for the um, like to, for the game to run smoothly while having a call. So, I'm gonna have to figure out some kind of compromise of the two. All right, so the game is currently starting up. Here we go, playing this game again. And hopefully you should see the gameplay. Yeah, I can see it. <laughs> yeah, so that's Columns. Okay. Yeah, so people have been recommending me this game. I think Voice even recommended it to me. Considering, you know... So, yeah. I've already played this game enough. So, I think the... I think the biggest issue I've encountered is uh, trying to balance out having a good, having a good call in Steam games. What you need is... A better computer? A new computer. <laughs> That's going to be on my to-do list after I'm done with BronyCon. So, um, the, uh, the other compromise I have to um, accept is that when playing Steam games, I have to, um, I have to like, stream while I'm alone on the, um, while I'm streaming instead of having a call because it's going to be way too awkward to... You know. Yeah, I 
get you. Mm-hmm. Oh, congrats, Jesse. I hope she has fun at the new experience of school. Yep. Oh, it would also help if I do this. We Wait. Did our <laughs> we there we did go. Our yeah, we did our turn with, um... The call's lagging right again, isn't up. it? Yep. Wow. What the hell happened? This computer used to run better when uh, doing streams. Is it starting to, like, get weak again? I don't know. It's off and on. It's like you fade in and out. And then out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Don't know. Get out of here. I'm trying to read something. So I've been noticing my friends have been dropping in games whenever I'm in a Discord call. Now I know Discord doesn't use a GPU. I did turn up GPU acceleration but it made no difference i don't know what gpu is All right let's see it's not really gpu it's mainly the ram because the background tasks like that consume a lot of ram and usage and some cpu so join a server instead of a call this is mainly discord uh, it's fault since it has been uh, doing this recently. Okay, so that explains that. So it's the people behind Discord who are at fault. Using is your upload and turn um, a high upload could increase your ping by a lot. A high ping on online games will cause your screen to be updated less often. Hmm. Yeah, it, it it sounds like a recent Discord problem. That's from what it looks like. Oh my god. I can see it right now. The uh the little bars right there. out right now uh, you know what I'm gonna do some research I've tried doing a little bit of research and yeah if, from what it sounds like I think it's a discord problem nah, I'm doing a different kind of research uh, what kind of different research I gave me computer research oh you need a new computer boy put Plain and simple. Well, that's been more than obvious for the longest time now. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We got an HP Pavilonian gaming desktop uh, on sale uh, for 600 uh, Maybe 230 uh, One hmm. terabyte hard drive, 128 gigabytes of solid state drive, shadow blight with brush tech airline. What? Speak English! What gibberish is this? Jibber jabber. I mean, is this... About, what's, what's Go ahead. RAM? Oh, no, uh, hang on. No, I'm yelling at the screen. Where's your... What is your RAM, computer? <laughs> Give me your RAM! Give me the RAM. What's your RAM? Give me. Give me. 8 gigabyte system memory. 8 gigs?! That's crap. I have 32. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, wrong folder. Oh, uh, then again, my computer's kind of a beast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If 
If I wanted to, I could probably live stream Alien Isolation and then some. I mean, if you want to. If I ever figured out how to stream, sure. Uh, I can show you the ropes. Maybe we'll see, cause I, I, you know me, I, I'm weird about posting stuff. I'm weird. Oh, here we go, an I buy power. That's the computer I have, or the computer brand I have. <laughs> what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Eight hey, gigabyte memory. Well, okay, eight gigabytes is enough. It's got the latest NVIDIA GeForce hard uh, 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 gaming card and a hard one terabyte of. Yeah, but you're gonna spend almost a thousand dollars. Or, 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 or. You could pay monthly. That's nice. Pay monthly? Yeah. Like 70, 84 a month. Pay it off within a year. Uh, paying off a computer or. Yeah, paying off the computer. That's here. new to me. Yeah, it builds credit. Huh. Yeah, Sounds interesting. This a look. Yeah, give this a look over. I budget that again. I don't know what your budget is. I'm guessing. Dropping that on Skype for you. Hmm. But yeah, this is a gaming computer. This is from my buy power. I did get a custom build personally myself from them. Had a few issues with it, with it, but that was supposed to be cut some Windows 10. Hmm. <clears throat> it's got a terabyte of hard drive space. It's got the latest ga graphics card. It's got eight gigs of RAM. That's pretty damn good. Ow! Fuck. Not as good as mine. <laughs> Jump! Fucking hell! <laughs> I'm sure it is. Show off. <laughs> okay, if you got. One, I would hate you. Wait, what? I'm gonna drop. If you get this one, I'm dropping it on Skype for you. I will paint you. You will paint me? Hate you. Hate. Okay. Noted. <laughs> Looking at it. Some, not really. I'm waiting for Skype to open so that way I can take a look. Hey, like. Oh, that's right. I clicked away or signed out of Skype in the hopes that maybe I would run the uh, stream better. Oh, I was wondering why I wasn't. You're, you launched in the. <sighs> You had the equipment to improve. Oh wait, that's that's different. Um. What's up with Golden and Twink's ship name? Oh God. <laughs> yeah, that's a thing. Somewhat. Ask Blissey, what is Golden and Twink's ship name? I was just saying that. Oh, uh, I didn't hear you at all. Oh. I hear you now, but... <laughs> yeah, including the belch. God, yeah. I still I still love that video. <laughs> it was too I much... I called them the Golden Twinkie. <laughs> Get them now while supplies last with a special flavoring of orange. A nice citrusy taste. <laughs> That sounds terrible. <laughs> it is a, it's an actual treat that looks like a Twinkie. It is gold, and you cut it to it, it's rainbow inside. <laughs> wow, $850. So 70 a month. Yeah. Hmm. That's not too bad. This sounds like an inter This is an interesting spin on paying for things instead of saving up a shit ton of money. Although, I was also recommended getting, like, custom computers. Or so whereabouts. Well, for that, I could definitely recommend I buy power. 
you go to our website, you can build it. Yeah. Well, no, and you and you pick out what you want, and they build it for you. Okay. Um. Where are you? Oh, there we go. All right. So, um. Like, okay, so the other question is, is that upon getting those, um, you know, your own custom build, do they have the same kind of payment plan, or does it, all have, like, have to be paid in one? Uh, I don't know if they do payment plans, so I'll have to check that. Didn't I just click this one? Yes, I did. I just clicked that one. All right, let me check the second one. Of course, you have to pick ones that have rainbows on it. What are you on about? Uh, Aeon's watching a magic show on Netflix, and there's a, and it looks Ouch. like a photo. Oh. 16 gigabyte rem, um, memory. NVIDIA G, GeForce GT 1032 terabyte hard drive. That's amazing. That is huge. Six. That, that's, that, those are beast computers, so I want to point that out. Hmm. Interesting. Does it have a Blu-ray player? I'm sure they're capable. No, I mean, does it have a Blu-ray player? These days they should, but I can check. It would be nice to have, because that would be a good use for um, extracting footage for movie reviews, you know? Yeah, let me see. Overview. It includes mouse, keyboard... The, 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 the Windows 10 this processor DVD CD burner no it does not look like it does with Blu-ray no it doesn't do Blu-ray but oh. I buy power I can link you the web however I can't seem to find if they payment plans alright I buy power here is where you can build your own custom alright so I guess there's a compromise with each of these oh, choices. There is. There is. Wait, what? If you go on the iPower, if you go on I Buy Power website that I just linked on Skype, right? Uh, they have towers available that you can customize, and you can pay as for some of these. Um, looks like eighty dollars a month. Eighty bucks a month. To a high, <sighs> or as high as one hundred seventy-two a month. All right, um... Oh, Jesus. Woo, god damn, look at that beast. That's... Oh, wait, no, my, my computer cost me 2300 Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I did very well at Brodycon 2016. <laughs> <laughs> or was it 2017? I... Don't know. No, it it, it, was, it was 2016. It was 2016, I remember. I did very well. <laughs> Ooh, and that one's pretty too. It's got like a rainbow laser going down the front. I've seen... Sucker butt. It's like, screw oh, the I details. I just want the rainbow. <laughs> okay, so I, I think I know what you're talking about. Gaming, RDY, CYRG202. Yes, the There's also one next to it that's just all red. It's like, ooh, that's me. <laughs> no, that's too edgy. Maybe if we're orange, then yeah. <laughs> uh, be edgy as hell. <laughs> stupid edgy term. You give red a bad name. I do not. I have red in my mane, and I have you know. I wasn't referring to you. I was referring to all the people who like to use black and red for edge shit. It's like... You know, it's because of shit like that you give Red a bad name. Edgy, 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 edgy. Yeah, no thank you. <laughs> edgy, edgy, edgy. Will I play Resident Evil Remake in the near future? On my own terms, yeah, but I can't stream it. Hmm. Windows 10. 2700,000 processes. Damn! What, was that like 2000 or something? It's a very powerful processor. I'll just put it to you that way. The, 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 these towers are not a joke. These are beast gaming towers. Beasts. Hmm. 
mean, again, when I knew when I was going to get my computer, I was going to go all out as much as I could afford. Right. I have a 2 terabyte hard drive, a 32 gigabyte RAM, the best processor top of the line of its year, and the graphics card to boot. There's yeah. an i7. Oh, of course, there's an i9. Of course, people want to go for the higher number. 15,000, understandably high. <laughs> okay, so they do have the option for customizing. Yes. All right, well... Let's go into customize for this second gen Ryzen here. Because maybe I can change the color. Unless that's just. I, oh, I see it. Okay, so. Let's see. Mouse pad, headset. Uh... Oh, look at that sexy beast. <laughs> yeah, that's a beauty, alright. An <laughs> LED keyboard. accessories lately let's see base components case fan lighting let's see here we go drives primary hard drive here we go optical drive i'm guessing that's for uh let's see external usb nope uh high speed media reader no nope. maybe it's primary hard drive okay so that's what that is so where's uh let's see video card processor fan lighting limited time offer service of support intel samsung hard drive huh. i'm spending a lot of time talking about this um i hope i'm not well, boring the chat <laughs> Find it boring. I'm trying to help you. I mean, if oh no, I seriously considering this. Oh yeah, no, like serious. Oh, of course. I'm just hoping I, that I just hope that you know the people in the chat are not getting so bored. <laughs> Would you maybe like? Maybe you could show them, show them what you're looking at. Um, I could. It's a little yeah. bit on the risky side. All right. Ant said he could help too. Oh, I'm sure he can. Because, like, the thing to keep in mind is that um, I I would still, um, I'm still sticking with my guns of um, waiting until, like, after BronyCon to start saving up to uh, get a new computer. Yeah. Um, there are just some compromises well, I currently have to work with. Ooh. If, you, if you're going to save up, these are the ones worth saving up for because when you buy these, you buy them for good freaking long time these things are going to be built to last they're built for playing hardcore games of today's present and even future generation so. now just just out of curiosity is that what it's only designed for just for games or can it also be used for like other material like other purposes oh it can easily be used for other things i, I mean in general i use mine for video editing okay yeah I use mine for video editing and uh, camera screen recording, stuff like that, primarily. But yeah, if I want to play a game as high quality as Alien Isolation, as demanding as graphics as Ark. Oh, I'm sure your computer would be able to handle it. By the way, Nickzilla, thank you for the link to uh, Newegg. Yeah, I'm back. Oh. Hello. And I hear an echo. Yeah, no, um... <coughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, well, no, by the way, whether or not it's you have any sort of future proofing, which most people avoid that word, does depend on what you're buying because you might be able to buy some tech that just when um, uh, some tech that just became a little bit older um, for a little bit cheaper. Because I know the 1070 is no longer the top end graphics card. Right. Um, so you gotta... might be able to get those on sale. Okay. It's the 280 now. Yeah, um... What was my graphics card? I mean, my graphics card would be more than enough for you. And it's outdated by... <laughs> three years. And it's still powerful enough. 
Hex, I'm... when I went to get my computer checked on some um, some driver issues, and they, they, they popped it open. Well, first they had to admire it. They said, man, this is a beast of a tower. And they pop it open. And they said, you only have this graphics card for it? Like, yeah. Like, honey, you could go so much bigger. <laughs> it's got the room. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like, I know, but okay. I didn't need it. for me. Just reading the chat. Um mm -hmm. By yeah, the way, sorry, Chad, Aeon can't see the chat. He's just get to help out where he can. Mhm. Mm By the way, um Peter, how are you feeling? Cuz I know that you and Lars had a cold. Oh no, dear. We had the flu. I, yeah, that's what I meant to say, the flu. Why did I get mixed up with those two? I think because uh, Rustic is really, really sick, and I think Solar got sick, too. Yep, I knew it! It's flu season! <laughs> I fucking knew it! I had a little bit of... Both their... I had to take both their butts to the doctor. <laughs> fucking hey. No, like, I just got through a cold, and to add insult to injury, my lower lip is, like, it's got, ugh, it, it's going through hell right now. Oh, uh, wait, so you just got over a cold, and now you have, like, a sore or something? Yeah, like, I have, like, a couple of cold sores at the bottom of my lip. Yeah. Yeah. Those aren't fun. I hope they don't get infected. I hope not either. Like, if it starts to get worse and worse, then, yeah, I am going to get worried, and I have to go to a doctor for that shit. Yeah, they'll probably just give you a... A medication, a neosporin. Like a neosporin on steroids, that's what I got when I had that problem. Yeah, like, I've already applied some ointment to it, and I, like, what is it, Blistex or something like that? I really hope it does well in its favor. Like, as of lately, it's not nearly as irritating as it was uh, yesterday or this morning, but still, it sucks that I have that. My bottom lip is ugly as hell. I can't even go in public with this. Uh... It sucks. I'm surprised the both of them have been surrounding me with their flu and their coughing and the sneezing and the, and the whining. No, they haven't been whining. They've been very good patients. <laughs> and I, I haven't got sick at all. Don't jinx Lars yourself. Is Lars is giving me the stink eye. Yes, you are a big baby. <laughs> <laughs> and I love you. <laughs> No, no, no. When I get the flu, I haven't got. Okay, I want to put. I want to point this out. I haven't gotten the flu since 2011, 2012. A really long time. Okay, I have not had the flu in forever. If I catch the flu now, I will be the biggest baby you'll ever see. Ugh. Like no, no, no. I don't get sick. If I get sick, the whole world's gonna know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna call up my mom. Mom, I'm sick. Come take care of me. <laughs> <laughs> Screw your job. Your baby girl is sick. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, world. You did nothing but got me sick. <laughs> <laughs> Lars and Aeon don't know how to take care of me. Mom, come take care of me. <laughs> it's like, I don't want you. I want mom. <laughs> <laughs> That's how bad I am. So, yeah. Um, damn. Okay, so I think I... I already I, answered that, Thomas. The customized okay. Elgato stream machine? Yeah. Oh. Oh, just reading out loud over um, a couple of um, other recommendations that other people have linked to me. Mm. I really like that you have these monitors that have a glass window and you see what's inside. It looks really cool. I like those too, but mine doesn't have that. I'm not that fast. <laughs> the fuck was that echo? What the <laughs> dick? <laughs> uh, I unmuted because I wanted to say something, but then I immediately coughed. Oh. <laughs> it's like... Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, no. Um, yeah, RGB is awesome. Uh, it doesn't really draw up the price that much either, at least not when building. Is that what it's called when it comes to the window walls of uh, the monitor? Yeah, yeah, like if you see that lighting, it's called RGB. Ah. Uh. I well, actually don't even 
I don't even recommend that because it might make a lot of noise and you don't want that. I, no, no, not I, even close. I it think, make, think so? that no. even if it were to make noise, that's going to happen either way because it doesn't come from the window side. It comes from the vents. Yeah, no, Blissy, the thing that makes noise are fans. I know, but if you have... Yeah, RG, RGBD, RGBD doesn't do jack shit to that. RG, oh. RGBD does things pretty. RGB okay. ain't got shit! My bad. But, okay, RGB, that RGB is, is so pretty better. cool. No, I'm, I'm looking at it though, and that it's open like that, but you can't put those paddings to eliminate sound from the fans. That's what I meant, if you have an open glass case like that. Okay, check this out. I just... Oh, the glass is pretty good. It's tempered. So, so check, like, I am not going to get this, but still, check this out. Like, that looks really you. cool. <laughs> I, I still like the other one with the laser rainbow going down the middle. That was my shit. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Okay, that's pretty cool. It got three fans at the front, and it's also windowed. It's RGB LED, and it's got, like, they, they kind of go around like a rainbow in and of itself. That looks like a yeah. computer that you would want. That looks uh, really cool. Yeah. That looks so badass. But I like Marshmallow. Marshmallow's been so good to me. I'm not saying anything against Mar... Is that what you <laughs> name your computer? Yes. <laughs> you know, you give better names than what uh, Chrissy loves to give names to. <laughs> well, mine is a big white... It's, it's all white with blue highlights, so I decided to call it Marshmallow. Chrissy gave a name to her computer. I don't remember what it was, but I do remember that my laptop's name was given Cucumber. And the my computer I gave you was Carrot. Yeah, it was Carrot. And the one that I'm currently using, uh, we call it Tomato. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> you give out sugary names, and you name your current... Um, Computer marshmallow. Is it white? I told you it's white with blue highlights. Okay, I may have I may have glossed over that. Hey, pay attention. <laughs> she gave you a cat crop. Should I shut up? Oh my god! <laughs> I saw what he did there. <laughs> you, a you know what I? <laughs> was that when I got Marshmallow, I mailed them. That cost me a hundred bucks to do this. I mailed you guys my old desktop because I thought it would help things. And it was. And, it, and, and then, then it, it decided... Yeah, it decided to give me the finger saying, no, I'm not going to work for you anymore. What the fuck did I do to deserve that? What did you do to kids? I didn't do anything. I was just... It was you know, like every now and then it would get that blue screen. But that was kind of bound to happen almost all the time because you installed Windows 10. And I spoke to Dad about this, and he said that, yeah, if you um, if you install Windows 10 on a Windows 7, it's always going to have problems. It kind of happens like that. I'm guessing it's supposed to be a company thing to get you to buy new computers. I don't know. It didn't give me a problem before. That's the weird thing. I'm guess I wasn't blue screening or anything. Hmm. It probably has more to do with your direct deck. With the DirectX rating on your hardware, if anything. Uh. Well, there is. I remember right, Windows 10 is like DirectX 11, 12 ish. If I'm going off the top of my head, but um, Windows 7 hardware can go back a little bit further than that, I think. Oh, that's right. Chrissy has one of these um these keyboards. The uh the rainbow uh the rainbow lighted uh keyboards. I saw those. Uh. They look. They're tempting, but don't they heat up? Uh, well, so far... RGB really isn't that hot. It Key really isn't as hot as you, you may think it is. Keyframe hasn't had any problems with that. It just It's just very light. Bright, I mean. Rainbow bright. See yeah, the but... shining light. Don't get mixed up those, with these goddamn words. Don't make that much heat. Those lights really don't make that much heat. Yeah, I'm picky with my tech. I'm weird. Like, I kid you not. I'm going to be forced to upgrade a key my keyboard at some point to a different brand because they don't make the same HP keyboard anymore. And I don't well, like doing that. It's, well, it's HP, so it's it's not like you're... It's not, I'm sure most of what you can get is an upgrade. It's HP, so... Uh, there's this, this nice little rainbow sort of look to this. I love that the back end is all red. 
And then it goes slowly towards yellow. What the hell is that fucking red doing between the green and the yellow right there? That doesn't make any sense. I'm going oh, a little OCD there. there. You're not Discord, Bliss. Shut up. <laughs> so, Goldie, what do you want this PC to do? Okay, well, that's... If I were to explain things, it's pretty much going to be like... It would be a very spoiled answer. But for the most part, I just want it to run well with any game that I work with. Whether it be emulation, Steam games, or uh, using a capture card. Because I did hear that when using a capture card when running a stream... Uh, it also uses up CPU. I could be wrong. That's just a theory. Um, and additionally, I, it would be nice if um, I had a Blu-ray disk drive, so that way uh, there's... Okay, um, let me help you out with this one thing. CPU, you probably want to look up. I know Intel is seems really tempting, but if you want to do a lot of gaming, especially on the cheaper side, but you want like a, a better performing graphics card, get look up AMD Ryzen CPUs. AMD. And I would say... Uh, <laughs> AMD. Oh, AMD. Uh, right. Yeah, AMD Ryzen because the Intel CPUs are nice, but they're a lot more expensive. Um, Ryzen has w tends to have a lot more uh, CPU core counts, which is a lot better for gaming, especially if price is not an issue. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, yeah. AM try looking for an AMD Ryzen CPU. Uh, well, and at least sixteen, and at least sixteen gigs of RAM. At well, least. I I don't think you could see the screen, but I'm currently on a page that says AMD Second Gen Ryzen Five X Daily System. I don't know if that if those specifics mean anything to what you just said. I'm just um, okay. Uh, check the other specs. Click on it. Okay, other specs. Uh, I don't even know where to look over here. Um, uh, you need to click on it. You need to click on it first. Like, go to that. Go to that PC's, like, page, and it should list the specs on it. Okay, well, um, let's see what we have. Let's see. Let's look at case, and, okay. Uh, fan like, lighting. I, need, I, need the I do not know how this page works. Oh, shit. Oh, that's case lighting. That's... Yeah, no, no, no. I'm, I'm saying look at the, um... Yeah. Um, look at that PC's page because you know off to the uh, left. Oh, over here. Um. <coughs> no, no. When I say off to the off to the left, I mean like, I mean like where you see like AMD's second gen Ryzen. Click on that text. I it's it's not a link. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay, sorry. Oops. Um, <laughs> something you may want. Well, here, like, I'm on the same page as him right now, so. Oh, you're building a PC. Yeah, okay. Yeah, he's looking into possibly a custom build like what I did. It, I think it's a better recommendation compared to um, an already pre built computer because you can um, put your own it, specs on them. I mean, you can, but I'm going to say something that I know um, others may, may or may not like to hear. Um, you. I. W if you really wanted the cheapest option and the biggest bang for your buck thing, don't even go pre-built because they charge you way more than it's worth in labor costs. What yeah. you should really do is just build the rig yourself. Because if you do that, you can get a way more bitchin' rig for the same price, or you're at least not overpaying for a lot of, I'm going to be honest, a lot easier to do self-assembly than you think. <laughs> okay. Except if you don't know how to build, then how do you do it? There are literally YouTube videos showing you how to do it in less than an hour. I, I, I have no confidence in that. To give you an idea, I could have, I could have overly maxed out your system rig and probably overclocked it if you, if I just did it myself and if I, and if I did it pre-built. Because pre-built, they do, you are paying a lot of hidden things like for the, you're paying a lot for the brand is essentially what I'm doing. Ah, yeah, I'm gonna grab some water. <laughs> All right. Um, one of the biggest things that I'm always afraid of, and this is because uh, Tommy Oliver ran into this mistake once, is that he put a lot of power into a computer, and it overheated it so bad. No, what he did was he he didn't. I remember him talking about this years ago. Um, yeah. If we're thinking of the same thing, he he built a powerful rig, but then didn't put a powerful enough power supply in it. 
So he, he fried his power supply. Um, all you need to do is make sure that you have a good enough power supply and you're good. Okay. Yeah, so this is just... There's a, like... Yeah, so just to make sure that, um... Oh, John, I shut the fuck up! Oh, my God. What's up? No, he's making... He's making jokes again. He's referencing Tommy Oliver from Power Rangers. Um, but, but no, um... The, wait a uh, second, do you mean Josh isn't Josh Scorcher? No, 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 no. Huh? I was gonna say, if we're talking about PC stuff, you shouldn't be cracking the joke considering what he did, but yeah. No, uh... Okay, did Josh do something really stupid to his computer? Okay, he didn't do something stupid to it. He somehow spent, like, what was it, an absurd amount of money... Uh, I th want to say it was over a thousand dollars, if not just under two thousand, on what essentially amounted to a potato. Oh, <laughs> oh God! Like he's instead of all that spending all that money, he had like a Core i three, thinking it was for hardcore gaming. And like every time he tries to do something heavy, especially whether it's streaming, gaming, or otherwise, he keeps bottlenecking all of his applications because the CPU isn't strong enough. Oh I still have no idea how the fuck he spent over a thousand dollars on a PC and basically bricked it with an i3. Oof. I just spent twenty three hundred on mine. Right, well, um, but I basically did what you told him not to do. <coughs> do I need to? Oh no, you can, you can build one. It's just you are paying. I'm not saying it's to shirk on you. Like way more than the PC is worth to assemble than it would be if you just did it yourself. Well, there you go. But yeah, and when it comes to CPUs, AMD AMD Ryzen is gen. At least if you were to buy this stuff and get it yourself, I'm willing to bet it's probably the same on here too. Um, AMD Ryzen is cheaper with nice thread counts. And again, you want at least 16 gigs of RAM. Right. And yes, this tends to happen when you have two people in the same room on two different devices talking in the same chat. Sorry, folks. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. clears throat> that's that's um, kind of bound to happen. I mean, it's either that or I... I plug in my good mic and unplug my headset. And as is, um... But then everybody's gonna hear him. Mm-hmm. But, um, well... What it really boils down to is saving at this point and knowing how much you're willing to spend and have a budget. I had a budget. Yeah. Um... Okay, dude, if you want, if you want some help with this as well, um... When you either have the money or if you want to do a test, uh, just call me because my PC is in a box over there. I just need to plug it in. Mm. Um, yeah, and I can I can walk you through the building process. Right, right. Um, in terms of like specs and shit. Right, but like I said before, uh, whenever it comes to going for a new computer, um, what, what I don't even know. Um, I always fly down to California, make it a week, make well, a week getaway. What, what I mean is, <laughs> what I mean is, is that, like I said before, when it comes to getting the new computer, this is something that is a plan that I would have set for after, um, after BronyCon. Hmm. Have a Patreon goal to help you save up for a new computer. Um, when it comes to Patreon goals, that's something that's in for the patrons, you know, you know, whatever their perks are. That I don't think that's anything to do with what's in for me. Uh, whenever it comes to something like that, um, I would have to really think about whatever it is, uh, if any Patreon supporters want something really, really big out of me. Um, well, so far, okay, Derek, so far I've tested out many of the games. Mostly the emulators have been running pretty fine, even when it came to, um, uh, Shit, what was it? I can't even think straight right now. Do I happen to have a coffee? Yes, I have a coffee page. Um, never used it for anything. Um, 
what about the Steam game changed? I don't know if I have that game or not. All I know is that uh, when it comes to Steam games, they're a little bit tricky to work with. And uh, as of lately, somehow it started to become problematic. I'm not sure why. Um, I'm sure there's a reason behind that, and I'm sure that there's a way around it so far. Uh, for the most part, um, I'm pretty much open to continuing um, retro games, but I may have to hold off on the uh, Steam games until I can figure out an alternative. And I'm more than open to uh, run more test runs, even when I get back into actually doing you know, game streams and such. The alternative is getting a new computer. <laughs> Well, that's that's gonna be a that's gonna be a while from now. <laughs> I'm just saying. I know you're just I'm saying. Back, <laughs> I'm back, bitches. That will never that will never get old. There's a lot of shit on our like on the streams that will never get old. I mean. The fucking kaboom. Kaboom! <laughs> <laughs> well. Hmm. I doubt this will be scary. It'll sound cool, though. Hold on, I gotta find it first. If, if you're gonna try to do another one of those sound clips, it's not gonna work. <laughs> no, but it still sounds cool. <laughs> oh, that's too priced. What was that from? Seriously? I'm gonna have to kill you. What? Just, just tell me. Oh, it's from Aliens? There, I got it. Okay. Okay, I haven't seen Aliens in years. And the only... Yeah, you're, you're the, the only moments that I will remember... There, there's quite a handful, but I don't remember the movie entirely. Like, I I remember uh, Bill Paxson saying, Game over, man! Game over! Uh, when both Ripley and the girl were stuck in, um, stuck in some place where she's trying to grab their attention, but the glass is bulletproof. And there's uh, also the last scene where the, I think it was the mother alien or queen alien who was on board the ship. God damn it, that's the same fucking death. Wait for it. Get away from her, you bitch! Best line in the fucking movie best Harry Potter quote ever best Harry what what is there supposed to be a joke in that yeah he he's just trying to piss me off and it's working <laughs> You're, 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 you're screwing up the lights from one of my favorite movies of all time that I can quote with my eyes shut. Well, of course you can quote with your eyes shut. It's memorization. I, I scare people with how well I memorize it. <laughs> I memorized Terminator 2. I memorized Jaws. I memorized Aliens. We're going to need a bigger boat. <laughs> Said it wrong. It's you're gonna need a bigger boat. Isn't that what I just said? No, you said we're gonna need a bigger boat. No, incorrect. So many people get that wrong. And it's not beam, beam me, me up, up Scotty. Scotty. It's Scotty. Beam me up. All right. Well. 
I guess that's the same kind of shit that happens with the whole Luke, I'm your father, which is not the real line. It's Obi-Wan never told Luke, you what I happened to your father. No, I, I am your father. father. No! That's not true. That's impossible. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. No! No! <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Every time Mark Campbell said that, it sounds like he's a child, like a child going through like the most unfortunate punishment that he does not want. He's cringing so hard. Ah. Ah. Holy shit! 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 Get up there! There we go. Don't die. Don't take this the wrong way, but you are a Terminator, right? Yes. Yes, Cybernetic Systems Model 101. Oh, Cyberdyne Systems. Cyberdyne Systems Model 101. Holy get out there. shit. You're really real. I mean, oh, oh. Get a grip, John. Okay, you're not here to kill me. I figured that part out for myself. So what's the deal? My mission is the front time. <laughs> yeah, just you did. 35 years from now, you sent me here to protect you here, in this time. This is deep. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a twist! <laughs> so, go so speaking of Dragon Ball, when you were making abridged jokes, have you seen the new super? Which new super movie? Oh, is it the new Broly movie? I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> so bad. bad. Fucking hell! Are you there? There you are. Yeah, I'm still here. Okay. Did you hear the question? No. Okay, thanks for Dragon Ball Z. I haven't watched in years. And I'm going to be expecting an explosion from Bliss. Or... First off, it's not Dragon Ball Z right now. It's Dragon Ball Super. Secondly... Oh, what the fuck ever? Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball this, Dragon Ball that, Dragon Ball up my fucking anus. You know what? You know, you know what? <laughs> you just suck. <laughs> Get out of your home once in a while and educate yourself. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm so accustomed to saying Dragon Ball Z all the fucking time. It's the most recognized subtitle in all of Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball period, not no, Dragon Ball. This isn't Dragon volleyball. Ball. First it's Dragon Ball, then it's Dragon Ball Z, then it's Dragon Ball Z Kai. And then it's Dragon Ball Super. Oh, Get Jesus. Get on my level, scrub! <laughs> Lying fish. I... Yeah, this stage was always a pain in the ass. Flying fi Why the fish are flying up in the air? I don't fucking know. They're just tossed right up in the air and you have to put up with it. Oh, God fucking damn it. Yep, there goes my OCD again. Not OCD. PTSD. OCD, PT, BSD. <laughs> I, thought, I, I thought you just said pussy. I literally thought you just said Well, pussy. sorry to disappoint you, Aeon, but I didn't. No, not you, Blissy. <laughs> <laughs> I am a good girl. Yeah, well, not from where I'm sitting, and I'm sitting in your living room right now. I am a good girl! Okay, you're starting to sound like that one character from, I don't know what movie it was. It was a musical, and she was constantly saying, I'm a, a good girl, I am, a good girl, I am. And she uh, she's going through some, uh, some un unusual circumstances that are questionable to her. I, like... <sighs> God damn it, I just got game over. Great. Yeah.
And to heck with Dragon no, Ball Evolution. We, we, don't, we, do we don't not we do not speak of that atrocity. I don't know what the fuck the writers were thinking when they were writing that. They have to. I don't know what the. Off, it wasn't the original writer. I didn't say original writer. It was somebody else who. What I was trying to say is, well, first off, what was wrong was that it wasn't the original authors or the original creator. That was the problem. <laughs> They put together something and just assumed, oh, we'll just put together anything and people will buy it. No, dumbass! Look up your goddamn research on the source material. What really ticked me off about GT was the the cleaner style. It hurt. The cleaner style? Like, everything was clean. You know, like, the, they, they all look plastic. The art style, you could just tell the art style was different, you know? I was mentioning uh, something completely different in the chat. Because they were referencing uh, that, that piece of shit live action movie. What live action? Dragon Ball Evolution. Oh, I, I, I don't even know. Oh, yeah, I don't talk about that. I was talking about GT. Yeah, no, Dragon Ball Evolution, it never happened. Never happened. No, that, that movie was a fucking fart in a church. When I saw the trailer, I just thought, <laughs> no, that's what it is. The, as soon as I saw the trailer, I'm just like, oh my god. That, it, it looks so embarrassing. They changed so many of the character designs to the point where I'm just like, this is nothing we remember from Dragon Ball Z. And when I saw that it was an official thing, I just, I could already tell, this is just one giant fart in a church. This is embarrassing. Fart? in a church what have you not heard that term before no this is a new term for me quote that and trademark that shit farts in a church I hate to break it to you <laughs> but that name was already taken from razor fist or rageaholic because uh, okay. he said that the mario brothers movie uh was a fart in a church And I could see why, because when that movie was out and people were excited, holy shit, did it backfire. People rightfully fucking hated that movie. <laughs> oh, here we got Babs got a chat room started. Okay. <laughs> Looks like somebody clipped a scene. <laughs> Tell Blissey Tracker. I'm not even gonna know. Let's see, what's worse, Dragon Ball Evolution or The Last Airbender? I don't know. Oh. Because. Can't they both be shit. <laughs> apparently, people find uh, era, The Last Airbender worse than Dragon Ball Evolution. And I'm sitting there thinking, well, okay, at least would. I think the greater insult with uh, The Last Airbender that makes it so sacrilege is that it's it, it had the potential to be good, but M. Night Shyamalan took his own liberties, and the liberties he took sucked and were so stupid. Like, why would you bother changing the pronunciation of the names to try to be more accurate? Why does that even fucking matter? Nobody even bitched or whined about that before. Like, you know, stupid shit like that. Whereas, you know, Dragon Ball Evolution, that was pretty much just, like, it, it was already doomed from the start. I don't know. Shifting gears to something possibly good. Resident Evil is having a series come out on Netflix. You know, I hope that, you know, it actually follows the game compared to the Paul W. S. Anderson movies. Cause God damn did I hate those movies like a pat like What movies? Um Resident Evil. Oh, turn your brain off, grab some popcorn, hang out with your friends, they're fun. Have you played the games? No, I, no, I don't play the games, but I watch the movies. The movies are stupid fun. They had nothing to do with the games. No, I, I know they didn't. <laughs> well, except for, like, the first one. The first one didn't have anything from the first uh, game. I thought there Did... was a game based off it. 
No, there was no Jill Valentine. There was no main character. They were completely new characters that were all made up by fucking Paul W. S. Anderson. And the, like the character Alice is a f what? There was no Umbrella Corporation. That's just a name and zombies. That's all you get. They didn't have the main plot where they're in a house. There was no there was no Jill Valentine. There was no um, Chris Redfield. It was nothing like what the game was. Basically, the whole movie was just a fan fiction that he decided to write. And over time, Alice became a Mary Sue. Well, yeah, yeah she is. Was, is, whatever. But still, I can have fun watching the movies. They're stupid fun, you know? To me, it, anyway. It's it's more frustrating to me. Fan, if you're a huge fan of the gaming franchise, though, then yeah, you're going to be vastly disappointed. I, I don't even play the games, and even I know the difference. And it irritates me because it could have it could have translated really well from the game, and it didn't. It was just its own entity. Mm. That's what's so frustrating about it. It's it's pretty much I find that to be an example of a video game adaptation done wrong. Well, I mean, it's it's kind of like, oh, freaking blob, got yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, it's kind of like, uh, well, AVP. They could have gone with the book idea, the first book written by, um, oh, I forgot his name. I'll have to find my, I don't even know where my book is. That was one of my favorite AVP? books. AVP? Wait, um, you mean Alien vs. Predator? Predator. Oh, yeah. okay, Bliss. Yeah, you, you know where I'm going. My, my point is is that they, they could have gone a different route with the movie if they had followed the book. But they didn't. Hell, they could have followed the second game, Alien vs. Predator 2, because that had a pretty good setup. They were just too scared to do it. They didn't want to go the Freddy vs. Jason route, which I'm, I hate to say it, but Freddy and Jason, Freddy versus Jason, worked out because, let's face it, Jason didn't have much of a profile to work, so they had to have it established in more of a Freddy Krueger system. Which means, in order for Alien versus Predator to work properly, uh, the Xenomorph theme needs to take center stage. That means it needs to take place in the future with Alien Yutani. Because then we could get the marines involved, and we could get some action, and we get some predator action. Then, yeah, let's make a movie in the Arctic with some random ass temple, a uh, hunting ritual we didn't really need to know about, and it was. Uh, uh, oh yeah, for the sake of continuity, let's get Lance Henriksen into the movie. Don't even get me started on AVPR. Just don't. Just don't. Well, I'll add this much. I'm watching the, the anime now. The first um, AVP movie was also written and directed by Paul W. S. Anderson. Sure loves to go for his own liberties. God damn, I'm sliding across like crazy. God damn it! I... Come on, touch that. There we go. Alright, so far the call seems to be going well whenever I'm doing uh, SNES games. You are lagging here and there, but it's livable. Yeah. <sighs> There we go. Demon head. Demon head. Demon head. What? Never mind. You 
missed it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ow! God damn it. Oh, my God. Okay, well, I'm just going to go ahead and play, I don't know, just some other game that I've already played. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just going to play some random game for the sake of it. Um, there we go, Vegas Stakes. Nope. What's this? It's kind of what? Rando. Jedi, shut the fuck up! <laughs> I love what Nelson calls it. AVPR, or some would call it. I can't see anything. What is going on? You know what would have been funnier, Nelson? I can't see shit. Get into the fucking card game. Ash Bliss. Thoughts about Aliens Blackout. Aliens Blackout. Research. Search. <laughs> Aliens Blackout launch trailer. Let's see. Don't die, Aeon. Uh, oh. uh. Nickel, shut the hell up. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. What are you going oh shit about? There's a new alien game coming. Oh. Huh. Alien Blackout. It looks like it's tied with the Alien Isolation game. It, it looks good. Let's try 50. Hmm. Except for one problem. And I just quote from my husband. It's Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh. But it looks Yay, good. I won. This would be a, like a fun oh, game to like stream he, at one point for just, I don't know, a chill out. And he and he just screams, it's for your effing phone. Wait, so this new alien game is for your phone? Ooh, this is a dangerous risk. Uh, One more hit. Jesus Christ, uh, this is a cock tease! Luigi, man, I, I, I would love to have help in my editing. The problem is, is that I'm very picky about how my editing is done, and I can't afford to pay anybody to do editing for me. That's kind of me sometimes. Woohoo! I won 150! If only. How long have I been streaming for, anyway? Oh, wow. I've been streaming for over two hours. You've been streaming for what? Two hours. All right, let's go for two fifty. All right. I cannot afford to pay people. Damn! No, I'm not, not a fan of RPGs. 
RPGs can take a really long time to play through. Yeah. And by the way, all I heard from you was re. <laughs> That's all I heard from you. Uh, why, Discord? Why must you be a pain in the dick? Okay, I'm gonna fucking stand there. I'm not gonna take the goddamn risk. Woo! I won 250 back. Sweet. Alright. Let's go again. Ace, nineteen. Oh, shit. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and stand here. No! <sighs> oh, so the maximum bet is 250. All right. Let's go for 150 again. 19. That's a very risky one. It's a leap of faith. That's what this all is. God damn it. I'm going to go ahead and... Yay, cool. All right. Yeah, go ahead and leave. Wait. What? No! Ah! All right, so one more round. Wow! Not even a fucking chance. Why do they call it blackjack if the blackjack is not even in there? Ah, whatever. Don't you? Yes, I know how to play it. I'm just trying to exit the game. Do you even know how to play, dude? Thank you. So I had to press select. Alright. Alright, let's go for a slot. Yay, slot machine. Let's go for $5. Oh. Okay. There we go. Okay. Just real life game. All right. Yeah, let's throw in all 25. What do I get from this? <laughs> all right, cool. Game not... G Thumbs, I don't even know what is going on with you. Name, not game. I said game. Basically loot box. Oh, ouch. All right. Yeah, I lost $30. Yeah. Roulette. Oh, it's one of these. Uh, I don't know, 14? Or maybe between these two. Uh, let's try 50.
Okay, how do I accept? Bingo isn't really a game of luck. One of eight, even. Mm. I never want to bingo. Wager information. Okay, um... I said name, not game. I meant the blackjack is too busy being used in the name of the game. Okay, so how 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 do I accept? Okay, I'm starting to get bored with this shit. How do I... <laughs> Which wager you have information on? I don't know. 17 to 1. Still... with it apparently that's i don't know unplayable craps poker yeah I do poker i don't know what craps is this is something i had to like look into in order to understand how to work with this okay tell me the guy on the upper left does not look like bruce willis mixed with dan Aykroyd. <laughs> max means that okay all right, um... Let's see, um... Check. Bet 20. Call. Uh, I'm gonna head out, Golden. I'll All see right. you later. Okay. Uh, Alright. What does Rays do? Uh, raise $5. Call. 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 That's one of the few um, options when it comes to playing this game. That's what that is. Somebody wants to raise 20. All right. Oh, somebody wants to raise it to 100. Jesus. Is this all just coming down to a total of, f I don't know, five cards from all of this?
Jesus Christ. Ha! Real funny, Bruce Aykroyd. I might even mention you in the chapter. How should you raise that 100? I don't know. Press A button to ant up. This is a game I'll definitely have to get used to because, Jesus Christ, it seems to be a little more complicated than it needs to be. I don't know, maybe one more game and then I'll just call it a night. I mean, as is, this is just all a test run, so. Here we go, a much simpler game that's fun to play. Alright, so Yeah, let's go yeah, let's go ahead. This is just this is gonna be like what, another fifteen minutes or something? Yeah, this is Tetris Attack. Um So far, um What's absolutely certain is that SNES games are still, um, workable. Um, it's still gonna be a l I still need to be, uh, I, I have to be restrained from a couple of things until, um, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, there won't be as big of an issue in the future when it comes to trying other games, but, uh, as far as trying to get a new computer goes, I still think I have to wait. It's good to be prepared, um for all of this so that way you know I just I can't be absolutely uh, yet um, but I still have to be patient with um, whatever else there is that I need to help um, take care of first I don't even know what I'm saying anymore long story short uh, for future streams I have to f uh, stick with what's usually there and still work on getting a new computer. And then hopefully I'll get a new computer. And then I'll be much more flexible with, you know, whatever else there is to stream. Because right now I'm very much restrained from doing anything. Um, this could impact the idea of doing a, um, a campaign of Castle Crashers. Because I mentioned before that I wanted to do that. Unfortunately, given the current circumstances... I don't think it's a good idea. I'll just go back to doing, you know, just, you know, the usual games and such, which is kind of bound to happen, you know, playing uh, retro games. I would never get tired of them. Um, I would need to think about what, like, what games to prepare in the future so that way, you know, I'll be much more set once I've um, gotten myself enrolled into uh, what other games planned out uh, in the future. So... I'm just, I'm pretty much giving my own conclusive thoughts behind all of this. Um, Pokemon is definitely something that I want to try in the future and hopefully not come across any um, serious call lags. If push comes to shove, I am going to have to start streaming on my own instead of um, having a call with. Because there's going to be some compromises that I'm going to have to be... Um, uh, come to. I need to check, uh, Twitch chat. There we go. Let's see. 
He's watched, but think he was done and go to bed. Um, I hope I don't hold, be, hold you guys up for anything. And the most that I hope to do is just entertain you guys when I'm live. Because otherwise, there's like pockets of silence, and it feels incredibly awkward every time that happens. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I've always loved having call, like, conversations during a stream. Because there's always something going on. Uh, but if I'm alone, I have to keep myself uh, on the line of doing whatever it is that I can to entertain you guys. And it is it is kind of difficult to juggle around. You have to have a good personality. You know, it's one of the reasons why, you know, some Let's Players like Markiplier and Jacksepticeye are so good at it. Or uh, that guy from Rage Quit. Um, ever heard of the MMO Fusion Fall? I, no, I have not. When it comes to MMOs, it's... It's like a second language to me, or like a separate language that I don't know of, or a foreign language. There we go. That's a better metaphorical uh, term to go with. So, yeah. Me too, because it makes gameplay more fun. Um... There we go. Booyah! I will say this much. If I ever get around to, like, streaming an episode of this game, uh, it's got, it's definitely going to be fun with uh, me and uh, Chrissy, because for the longest time, we've been wanting to do something like this together. Maybe it'll be on Valentine's Day. That would sound nice. But, you know, we've got real-life stuff to take care of, and, uh, you know, anything could happen. But... So I'm not going to, like, keep my... F well, maybe I should keep my fingers crossed. Like, I'm not going to be doubtful about it. But... Um, th th I'm just, like, thinking out loud on... God knows whatever else I will need to do. Um, wasn't Fusion Fall the old Cartoon Network? I, love I don't even know. Why not have Keith stay with you? I don't even know. Oh, okay, there's a question uh, that I got to read out loud. Do you have any convention plans as of yet? Um, so far, it's keeping me up. Now, nah, I'm waiting for my roommate to get back from his game night just to make sure he's okay with Icy Ru What the fuck are you even talking about? Ugh, I'm... I've lost track. I'm losing my goddamn mind. Okay, that is cool. I don't know who Michael Jones is. Yeah, whatever the case is. Sorry if you feel embarrassed. Uh, let's see. How high can you chain this game? The highest I've gone, I haven't kept track of, but the last time I played this game, which I think was last night, um, uh, I went up to 15 minutes. I didn't keep track on the levels. Boing. Ooh, ooh. Let me see if I can... Shit, I can't. I could have made like a nice four row right there. Let me try a little trick here. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. God, the music in this is just so happy. That's the one thing I definitely have to give Nintendo credit for. They always, um, they can always have uplifting music. Ooh, nice little combo right there. This game sounds like fun. It is fun. It's very fun. It has a very wonderful soundtrack. Uh, basically, they're remixes of uh, Yoshi's Island, but um, with, uh, you know, a little bit of a charm to it that that you can't help but appreciate. It's the kind of music, like, happy music you would, like, hear in a wide variety of, like, I don't know, a lot of Mario games without, uh, you know, using the main theme. 
Because the other thing that I love about uh, Mario music, aside from the, you know, the iconic, you know, dee -dee 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 -dee, is that they can have a really good atmosphere, especially in Mario 64. A lot of their music is very atmosphere driven to the extent where when I say atmosphere, I mean, it gives you a certain vibe or a feel. Um, the biggest example would be the Jolly Roger uh, Bay, I think it's what it's called. It's one of those uh, water stages. It sounds so gorgeous every time I hear it. Maybe I'm not finding the correct uh, term for that. When it comes to music, I mostly focus on like what the key it's in and how the composition works and what the beat is and such. Um, atmosphere, I think that can mean a lot of things. Let's see. Fusion Fall Retro. Fusion Fall Legacy is the original game remade from the new generation. Um, I'll have to look into that. Um, you know, while I'm still doing this, you know, you guys can, um, also ask me other questions. Or I think you were asking me questions, but I may have overlooked them. So. Okay, tell Golden. At least that's how I describe it. And no, Derek Brony, the developers can't make money from either of the games because Cartoon Network would sue them if they do. Well, um, I'm not going to do that then. Uh oh, oh, wait for combo. Ah, oh, damn it, I should have dropped that other heart on there. I would have had a four in a row. God damn it, why did I do that here? Oh, okay. I can just take care of that. So, yeah, uh, okay. Sounds like you could be a composer like me. Red Galaxy? I didn't know you did uh, compose music. No, um, I have a whole uh, can of worms when it comes to making music. Um, I'm not going to go in too much uh, into that. Because, um, you know, I don't want to sour the mood. I kind of have some negative uh, experiences when it comes to making music. Oh, I could have made a four row right here. God damn it, Brett. Come on. I was better at this. Eh, whatever. Let's see. Uh, do you have any plans this weekend? Honestly, weekends don't really mean anything to me anymore because of my work schedule and the kind of predicament that I'm in. Um, I'm not going to go and point fingers at anybody. I am going to try to uh, make use of the weekends and make those somewhat of the weekend times the uh the equivalent of you know because most likely uh friday and saturday or thursday and friday because around those times that's when most people are excited for the weekend and that's when streams would happen and that's something that you know people would have you know something to look forward to um for the weekend and not just you know it's really just those mundane um marketing strategies that I hear all the time that I'm pretty sure you guys know about. Um, I think that's something that I would, could, you know, set a, you know, a good, uh, set a legit schedule for. Because every time I tried making a stream schedule, it's always been questionably difficult to work around because of other circumstances. And uh, it's been kind of frustrating working around those. So, okay, to, for clarification, the developers won't put in the description fees because... They can't make money from the games, otherwise Cartoon Network would sue them if they do. Uh, let's see. Do you play and own Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter, Golden? Mysteria beats me at both those games we play. I do have Street Fighter. Um, physical cartridges, I have Turbo in the original. Um, I would. It would definitely be fun to do a stream of that. Um, obviously through emulation, but um, it would definitely be one of those occasions where I would have a second player. Because there's really no use in trying to do a main campaign with a fighting game. And I'm starting to lose it. Uh, oh, fucking hell. I need to let that go. <laughs> uh, let's move you here. Oh, holy shit, that's awesome. Alright, uh, 
let's see. Uh, what else? What else? Let's see, it's times it's easier to play by ear than to try to keep a strict, steady schedule. I I don't think I understand what you mean by ear. If you're talking about uh, having a schedule for when I stream, um, I don't know. Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Move over here. God damn it. Come on. Oh my god. I am about to lose it. Shit, 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 shit. God damn it. Come on. I got this. I got this. Okay. Whew. All right. Trying to pull all these down. Ooh, that's awesome. All right, cool. Drop that down, and... Woo! Yeah, boy! Drop, and... Woo! I am on fire! Oh, that was cool. Um, as for any starting game, when I get back into streaming, I I'm thinking out loud again. You know, I don't think it's any question you guys have asked me. Um, I do want to open myself up to what games uh, you guys would want me to stream. The only problem is, is that most of the time I was asked certain games that I cannot uh, run. You know, like certain, uh, like, later console games like luigi's mansion for example that's that's kind of an example uh, during halloween and i you know i stated before i can't run that because i don't have um like i have a gamecube but i don't have a capture card for it and i don't think this computer can handle it so i'm very limited to retro games so far um there we go just spitballing a lot of things that are on my mind so Ooh, I made a four right there. I didn't even realize it. Holy shit, am I about to go past 15 minutes? With 64? Um, unfortunately, I can't even run that either. I tried doing that, and it, like, it liked too much. Like, even when I wasn't streaming, so... Sorry, I can't do that. Although it would be nice, because I would love to do uh, Ocarina of Time uh, at some point. A game in which I know a lot of people consider to be overrated. Um, but I still enjoy the game regardless, you know? <sighs> Being a little focused here. Shit! I'm trying to think of other options to work with. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got a row. Move you here. There we go. Trying to buy some time. God damn it. I could have made a row right there. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Yoink. Let's see. Thumbs, I'm gonna give a pass on uh, uh, Fusion Fall. Have you, have I ever played Crusader Kings two? I do not know what Crusader Kings two is. It sounds like a sequel. And it looks like I'm about to lose it. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Shit! Ah, nope, nope, I lost it. I was almost at 16 fucking minutes. I went to level 31. Ugh. All right. 
Um, I'm gonna make a future tweet at some point, uh, on what to start off with. In the meantime, I do have a new opening to work with for when I get back to doing actual episode, um, you know, episodic Let's Play, so... Until then, I hope you guys enjoy yourselves, and, um, you know, sorry for the awkward silences and the weird conversations that I was having while, I don't know, you guys were here at the last 10 to 15 minutes of playing this game, but whatever the case is, um, I'll just go ahead and call this a stream, and, um, I'll be catching you guys later, so, hope you guys had a good night.